We're almost to the good part. I have attached the top piece of the jumper. What you do is you put your right sides together and pin. You have to make sure that when you pin it, that your lines align because that it's so annoying to me when your lines don't match up. So make sure you pin it around very carefully and match your notches that you cut in from the pattern. And so next I'm moving on to the sewing machine to attach the top. Then I'm going to put the elastic into the waistline. Then I'll come back and let you guys know how I'm doing. Okay. I have attached the top bodice to the bottom part of the pant legs of the jumper. And I'm going to create the casing now. And for the elastic go through so we can have that cinched to waistline. Um, here's the elastic here. I'm going to just kind of fish it in with a big safety pin and feed it through. And right now I'm about to finish off these raw edges. And then I'm going to um, sew it down, tack it down, and then to create the casing and put my elastic through. As you can see... I finished all the raw edges by serging them. It just gives your work a little bit, it's a, it's a neat, refined finish. So I'll check back in a little bit. All right, my savvy sewers. All right, so, so far, I've just done my casing. And what's, in, and look, it's really neat, and I'm going to then insert my elastic. With this casing, I turned it inside out, and what I did was I surged the ends, then I went back over it, and I actually, oops, sorry, I tacked it down really close to where I surged it. Then I left an opening, because that's where I'm going to put my pen in and fish the elastic through. Then I'm going to go in and seal it up. All right, I'll be back as soon as I put the elastic in. Thank you. The necktie, I've completed that. And if you notice the little fringes, I just kind of cut some of the excess excess um, fabric off, you know, with these scissors. But what I'm going to do is, some people have a hard time with the tubing doing a necktie on, uh, you know, turning it inside out. So what all I do is add a safety pin, pin it up top, and feed it through, feed it through. And as you're going, pull it, pull it, pull it, and just keep feeding it through. And this will help you even with the smallest thing, uh, necktie, belt, or strap. Even with the tiniest strap, it helps, and it's fast and it's easy. I've seen other methods where people fish it through with uh, long antennas and things of that sort. But this, to me, is the easiest, fastest way just to do it with a, a safety pin. You can do it a big safety pin, a small safety pin, just pin it and keep fishing that baby right through and pull it some and just keep pushing it through. finish and I'm gonna keep going till I finish and look now it's inside out the way I need it to be yes so I'm gonna finish pulling this on out but you get the gist of it and it's way easier than just trying to fish it through so much easier